Hey, what's up guys? Tony here from Apple Ties 5 and in this video I'm going to show you how to clean up your device, remove all unused tweaks and just restore your device completely like if it was new. It's going to go ahead and keep your current firmware that you are running so if you are on 6.1.2 and you do have a jailbreak you will not lose the jailbreak and your firmware will not update. You'll stay on the current firmware you're on. So I'll go ahead and show you that I'm on 6.1.2, which is a jailbreakable evasion firmware. And I do have Cydia. So I'll go ahead and show you. Here's Cydia. And I do have a whole list of tweaks on here, which I use for video purposes. And I do need to clean it up. So I'm going to go ahead and show you everything I have installed you can see I have everything I have a lot of tweaks on this device and I do need to free it up so it could run so I want to go ahead and free my device so I can have free space so if you want to restore your device and keep your and stay on 6.1.2 and keep the jailbreak this method is for you so what you want to do is you want to go to Cydia and you want to install mobile terminal you want to make sure you have mobile terminal installed and you want to add a source so this source you're going to need if you want to restore your device it does show you have it just like that and then you want to put the force slash at the end and just hit add source this is the first thing you want to do after you install mobile terminal the correct well here it is right here anyways it did load up the source I just need to update so you go to iHack you go to ilex info which is this repo right here and you install the very first one which is ilex rat hit install it's 1.5 megabytes go ahead and let that install Remember, like I said, you do need mobile terminal installed. So now that this is installed, you're going to want to go to mobile terminal. It is free in the Big Boss repo, if I'm not mistaken. So you have a few here. So I would select the very first one, mobile terminal 520 2. That's the one you want to install. So go ahead and install that too. And once you have mobile terminal installed, that's about all you're going to need to restore your device. So now that mobile terminal is installed, close out of everything and look for mobile terminal. Once you see mobile terminal, you're going to want to type in R-A-T. R-A-T. Hit return and it'll start working. And you'll get these options here. Number one will say remove all Cydia app tweaks at once remove all tweak settings number three clear city of cache you can do all these things with ilex rat but what you want to do is you want to restore your device to pretty much wipe everything off and keep your current firmware and Cydia so you're gonna to want to select number 12 so select one two and then hit return and it'll start to work you'll get this warning it says it's going to erase all content and settings jailbreak and unlock stay do you want to continue then you select Y sorry letter Y and then select return and it'll start it'll say please wait and this will take a few minutes because it's going to clear everything off your device but your device will be returned to stock and you will be jailbroken still so here you can see it started and your device may dim and maybe may lock all you have to do is unlock it and just wait do not do anything to it do not hit the home button just wait and it will start doing this and this is pretty much just cleaning up your device removing all tweaks it will also remove all apps from the app store it will just give you a whole brand new fresh device but you will keep your current IPSW 
and you will still be jailbroken. So I did it on my iPhone 4S right here. And I just pretty much after I wiped everything off of it, I just added very few tweaks. I just have square icons and stuff like that. So it will dim a little. All you have to do is touch on it, make sure it doesn't dim out all the way. So now it's removing applications and stuff like that. So it, it did start, it took maybe like one minute before it started. But once that was started, you can see it goes very fast after it starts. So like I said, if your device does lock at first, you know, just unlock it and wait. And now it's going to say, do you want to reboot? And all you have to do right now is select Y and return. And it just reboots. It's pretty quick, pretty simple. And I love the fact that I don't have to connect to iTunes at all. So I can just do it right on the device and after my device comes back I can plug it back to iTunes and add my apps and everything back on. So there it is. You're back pretty much to original. I'm going to go ahead and unlock. It's going to ask me for a couple things. There you guys have it. It's back to original. But I am still jailbroken and I will show you as soon as I get this. It's going to ask to connect to Wi Fi and all that. <clears throat> so there it is. Next. Enable location services. Next. Sign in with Apple ID. I signed in. Agree. It's going to set up my Apple ID. Use iCloud. Next. My computer. Now you get to see you, Siri. Click next. Don't send. Next. Start using iPod Touch. So here you have it. You're back original. Everything's gone. You have no applications, but you still have Cydia. So I'll go ahead and show you in settings, general, about, and you will see that I, I'm still on 6.1.2. I have available 27.4, so it wiped everything off. So there you guys have it. This is how you restore your device and keep Cydia. So I'll go ahead and show you that Cydia is working. So what you want to do now is you want to obviously reload Cydia. So you get you'll get all your Cydia packages and like I said your sources will still be there. And the Ilex rat source will still be there so in case you want to ever use it again, it'll be saved. So that's about it guys. This is how to restore your device without losing your jailbreak or without updating to a newer firmware. Comment below, give me a thumbs up if you like my video, and don't forget to